Now, I'm going to admit, every day I wake up, I don't always want to do the right thing. I don't always want to let just people pass by, try me, say stuff to me. I don't always want to pay full price for everything I got to pay full price for. I don't want to, but you know what? My conscience and my conviction, when that's not working, when that don't hit me, it's pictures like this that remind me that jail, prison, behind them bars will never be for me. If you ain't never been to jail, this picture... This should be enough to tell you to sit your don't want to be in jail down somewhere. I just want y'all to pet. Don't worry about that dry macaroni and the cheese in the corner. Don't worry about that bread that look like it's been left out for five days. I don't know what that goo got throw up stuff, mud stuff they got in the tray. It's the uncooked hot dogs behind that Halloween spoon sport for me. I them hot dogs look like they were. They were they were baked in in the in the twenties. Those hot dogs look like if you bite into them, they might bite you back. This this picture is enough for me to never even not think. I don't y'all ain't even gotta take me on scare straight. Y'all ain't gotta bring the one black dude that was on Ricky Lake and Jerry Springer and Maury and all the other talk shows that came out there with the vest on and they screamed at the screamed at the men. Shut up, shut up, stand up, stand up. Then he came out and he screamed at the women. You gonna be all right. You gonna be okay. You gonna be safe. You remember that black guy? I don't know what him yelling at those women. I don't know what that was supposed to do. But anyways, I'm getting lost. I don't even need none of that to not want to go to jail. This picture here, this picture going to make me pay my taxes on time, my tithes on time. This picture going to make me never steal nothing. I ain't going to never bother nobody. I ain't going to never shoot nobody. I, ain't, I might not even yell at nobody just looking at these hot dogs. Those aren't Franks. Those aren't ballpark hot dogs. Those hot dogs are prison park hot dogs. Those hot, hot dogs are child time hot dogs. Conjugal visit time hot dogs. Them hot dogs ain't not. Nah, nah, my dad ain't never talk about taking me to the ball game and eating prison hot dogs. Those look like they was boiled in cold water on a cold stove on a stove that was off. Look at them damn hot dogs, man. Nothing needs to be said. If whenever somebody get loud to you, just text them this picture and say, I do not mind sending you here. Everybody going to say, you know what? Never mind. Where did they grow these hot dogs from? Because these hot dogs didn't come from an animal. Nope. Y'all can't convince me that these damn hot dogs came from an animal. I ain't finna yell at my children. I ain't gonna even look at my kids me if that's gonna end up in a place like, look, Y'all, just look at the look at these damn hot dogs, dog. Look like Porky the Pig ain't die for this. He ain't die for y'all to be eating his fourth cousin that slept with his fifth cousin. These hot dogs, this is this is a hot dog that came from a brother and a sister pig sleeping together. Y'all can't tell me different. These are ancestral hot dogs. Y'all can't tell me no different.